Jody, Hi. yeah, you you are within the good boy caucus, aren't you? He's a good boy. Whoever got bitten should just get over it. He's a little rescue dog. You know what? He's protecting his mommy and daddy, and he's in a new place, and he's scared. And you know what? Because he's probably smart. He's probably a Trump holdover. He's probably a Trump lover. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Good boy. Yep. Good boy. Yep. Look at yep. Chris. Dogs know, like like you, small you, children. Dogs know. Chris is you like. You don't know any of that. I Chris is such a cat person. Chris is like, who's got a little pink nose? Who's got a little pink nose? Oh, Boots does. Oh, hi, Jazz. Oh, look, Jazz is awake. Oh, cat people. Have you ever been bitten by a cat? Because I have. That's way yeah, worse than being yeah. bitten by a dog. You don't even see it coming. You think, oh, they didn't even do anything. And then suddenly blood appears everywhere, right? So fast. You're just like, <laughs> oh, good. I got away with them. Yeah. They don't know they have razors on their feet. <laughs> they do. They do. They do. I remember my ex's cat. I was like, oh, she's so playful. Uh-huh. Oh, that's fun. Let's play. Oh, my God. I'm <laughs> bleeding from everywhere. <laughs> that cat was a bitch. I used to bring that cat sushi. I'd be like, here's some really good ahi. Please don't kill me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Jody, to my point, uh, Georgia Democrats just tweeted, if you're feeling shocked by racism in the British royal family, just wait till you hear about the bills Georgia Republicans are voting for today. Our caller yeah. just mentioned them. I mean, they've given up all pretense, haven't they? Of this is yeah, about voting. They know there was no voter fraud in yeah. 2020. It's just too many people voted. And when people yep. get to vote, they yep. tend to vote for Democrats because we represent a lot more people than they do. They're just cutting hours, no mail in voting, no absentee, no this. We're, I mean, it's just, it, it's astounding, right? That they've just. They don't have anything to vote for, so they don't want right. you to vote at all. And how many Republican senators are just giving up or quitting? They're just, I mean, this party is just lost. You've got Donald, I don't even know how they, how do they react today to Donald Trump coming out and saying, send all the money to me, don't send it to the Republican Party. I, I, how is how is Lindsay going to deal with that magic um, that, magic. that Donald has? He's a magic Donald's- man, mama. Did he actually say that, Sean? Did, did Lindsay say that, Travis? I, we played the sound bites yesterday. Did he say he's a magic man, mama? I, I don't think those are the exact words, but he did almost call him his boyfriend. His boyfriend. I heard he did. He, my bo- yes. he was my bo- friend. He's friend. My he's my friend. <laughs> he was my boyfriend. That was one of Lindsay the over so the good. overwrought clips from the Axios interview yesterday. Yes. Yes. <laughs> did I say- <laughs> okay. Um. Yes, he said he's he's yes he's going to make all the money magically disappear from disappear, the Republican Party yeah. into Donald Trump's with some colorful scarves and doves. It will just all disappear into Donald Trump's bank account. Isn't that weird? <laughs> yeah. He said he is a man. All their money. <laughs> <laughs> he already lost them. The, lost their house. See, they're already homeless. They he lost them the house, the Senate, and the White House. Carrying a handkerchief on a stick. Yes. And a chair of and their dog. That's all they need. Thermos. Oh, my God. Yeah, that's how we need to, right? Regardless of the filibuster, that's how we need to fix it. Get all those seats. We need to mm-hmm. really take back the Senate in 2022. Mm-hmm. How many people are leaving? Yeah. Right? Rather well, than defend, already, defend this. Four is what I heard. Yeah. Rather yeah. Than, there are already it, 20 seats up for the GOP anyway. So if these people were already going to run in 22, yeah. it's not really adding to that. But I think it's it six. might I think, make it easier to win. I think it's six, isn't it? Republican senators, Blunt, Portman, Burr. I think it's six of them are. are uh, I've heard four this morning, but no. I could be wrong. Skeet Adler. Yeah, no, it's, I've heard it's six. four. Really? Maybe four for the next Senate election, and then maybe two more after that. Maybe. I don't know. But anyway, uh, Jody, it's. Uh, yeah, this is. <laughs> oh, by the way, of course, Jen Psaki, because she's awesome, is with us on Team Gaboy. Major's a Gaboy. There we go. It's cut 13. Yes. I, I don't have any uh, I don't have any specifics. I don't have any updates for you, Mika, on on the reports about about an incident. But what I can tell you as a dog lover, I know you are, is that Major and Champ are part of the Biden's family. Uh, they're members of the family. They often go to Delaware when the first lady's traveling uh, and they're adjusting to their new home. But, you know, I, I don't have any more in those reports. I just know that they're they're beloved uh, members of the family and, of course, of the White House family, too. Yeah. Good boy. God. Boy. Thank you, Jen. How's the person who was hey, bit? Saki. Hey, 
Sasaki. Yeah. Get the show on. Get yes. Um, I, it could be, Jody, I'm a little more sympathetic uh, being the owner of a, a horrifically ill-trained beast that is sitting right uh, next to me. <laughs> Ready to pounce. You may have seen I've seen her sit me and... next to me prior to this. She has actually yeah. spoken into the microphone before, so there's yeah. that. Yes. Yeah, she that she was like the canine version of you yesterday. She literally climbed to me chair and tried to push me out of my seat to co to host the show. She didn't really even want me as a co-host. So it's so all about Eve dog version going on over here. Okay. All right. Um. So what? Okay. Yes. Oh, by the way, Megan Kelly has some tips for Oprah Winfrey on hosting. Really. <laughs> Really? <laughs> really? Really, Megan? Yeah, Soledad O'Brien said, Megan, uh, America's best-known advocate for blackface, has something she liked to say about the two black women in that interview and checks notes that had three people in it. Mm -hmm. yeah, but yes. she has a problem with the two black women in the interview? Is that? Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, Megan. Yeah. Maybe she can have a sit-down with Oprah about how Santa is white. Don't we have that, mm. Sean? We have, yes. That Wasn't that her major... Contribution to that society one, yeah. is that Santa? Yeah. Santa is white. Santa is white. Jesus was a white man too. No, you can't take no. that. Santa Not even trying to change them to fit some sort of a political agenda. All right. Santa is white. Santa is white. All right. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Um, Tyler tweeted, it's very funny that when one black woman levies legitimate criticisms against the royal family, a bunch of people with 1776 and their Twitter usernames become staunch monarchists. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, yes. what's, what's up? What's up with that? Did you watch the interview? I did. Yeah, I, I did. actually stayed I up late and watched yesterday. it. Yeah, yeah, I still have only seen clips. I don't know how to watch the whole thing. I still couldn't find it. How do you do it? <laughs> I've just seen it's clips. <laughs> Oh, on YouTube, oh, on the YouTube. Yeah, list? you can probably find it on demand. Oh, mm -hmm. all right. Go to CBS on demand and oh. look for it. Oh, thank you. Okay, I just. Any, do you want me to come over and y I'll yes. show you? Yes. Okay. I've had COVID. I'm. I have superpowers and immunity. And I'll, I'll triple mask up and glove up and yeah. I'll help. Full body condom. Okay. <laughs> um. Okay. Neil Katyal for the win yesterday. He said, "I'm glad Mr. Trump has finally found his footing." Defendant in a racketeering case is just about the only job that's appropriate for him these days. Oh, bam. Oh, bam. Uh-oh. You know what, Sean? I think it's uh -oh. that, that button in particular. Oh, no. I got it now. No one help me. Okay. All right. Okay. Um, Jody, it's hard to say. What it, where are your bets? Georgia case? Racketeering? It looks like now they're bringing in a building in Chicago into the whatever mm -hmm. the case is. Uh, I mean, Trump he obviously Chicago, yeah. did the, what? what's the thing called? He obviously overvalued, it's tax fraud, it's insurance right. fraud. Yeah. He undervalued yeah. for uh, um, taxes. He overvalued, overvalued for bank, for that's bank fraud. Right. I don't, well, why, even the, go, the, why even go to law school? I get to bank fraud, it's <laughs> tax fraud. It's not he, hard. What? And what was a $100 million of the loan for the Trump Tower Chicago was that's, just magically right. forgiven. Right. right. Yeah. yeah. It's weird how that happens. Okay. Hmm. Um, oh, speaking of uh, senators retiring, yeah, Amy Siskin said, what's happening with Republican senators retiring reminds me of the mass exodus in the House in 2018 by Paul Ryan and a host of senior Republicans. Mm -hmm. They don't want to be associated with the taint of the former guy, but they're also too chicken to stand up to him. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. And as Eric Bowler said, they still yeah. wrote a basically Democrats and how passing a COVID relief bill with 83 percent approval rating in the public is a gamble for Democrats. Gamble yeah. in a gamble for Democrats. They pass a bill. I'm like what? Really? No. How is this bad for? OK. Um, yeah. And then uh, the Trump sending at the same time, sending out the statement um, telling Republicans to donate to him and not the RNC. How are they going to how are they going to dance around that one, you think? I, I don't and know. And still kiss his ass. Right. I don't. I, yeah. They will. And there's yeah. no reason for they it. Will. He's not going to help. What's the point of kissing his large, bulbous, disgusting, orange buttocks? Gelatinous treason weasel. Pass. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff Teeter. Oh, you know his, his ass is so dimpled it looks like a golf ball. <laughs> oh, cellulite. Oh, cellulite. Oh, man cellulite. Uh -huh. man cellulite. Oh, yeah. oh, dear. Oh, it's like oh, cottage God. cheese. Sorry, we couldn't help ourselves. <laughs> um... Yeah, it looks like what's that? What's that disgusting dish that some people serve? Is it Thanksgiving? Koi? Well, some sort of Jello mold. Tapio tapioca pudding. Oh, what is like a creamsicle? Oh, colored... you're. I know what you're thinking of. Yeah. Oh, ambrosia. Oh, his ass is like ambrosia. That's the right color. That's the right color. Oh, he has an ambrosia ass. Oh my god. Oh. I love ambrosia. Oh, eck, you would, cat person. Who's got a big nose? 
Major's a bad boy. Oh Who's, got a big nose? Who's got a big nose? Wow. What? Just, oh, I'm sorry. Oh, there's a lot of possibilities. That was like some, ex- weird. some excess penis. It was totally I, it's un- not my fault. It was totally It was weird for. last Tuesday, Jody. It's, it's Tuesday. It's Tuesday. You said you would see me today. So I, I felt like it's my job <laughs> to supply extra penis. Okay. It's Tuesday. Hello. I live to serve. Okay, Jeff on t- Twitter says, Joe Biden was wrong to call Republicans Neanderthals. He should have called them a tangle of science-denying weasels. I think that's better. It's more descriptive. Yeah. I like it. Yeah. I liked it. All right, and Jody, as we were saying, we opened the show with uh, Lindy tweets. Just seven weeks ago, only 8% of 65-plus were vaccinated. Today, it is 60%. Sleepy Joe turned out to be Speedy Joe. I mean... I mean, yeah, my sister just got her second one. My niece got her first one. She's and Rachel got hers down here at the forum and said it was smooth, like no problems at all. We are furiously to get to the forum than to get the shot. So. Searching for underlying conditions, Chris. This would uh, Hamish on Twitter is like us. He's old. Maybe that he said I tweaked my back today getting off the couch. It is especially disappointing after spending the last year training for this event. Yeah. Someone else said, reminded me, they said, I, I'm starting to get sports injuries in my sleep. That's that's us. We're old. Can't we just, just old. Yes, we are. Just say, I threw yep. my back out reaching for a pen. Does that, can I get a shot? <laughs> I, I tried the BMI thing. It didn't work. All right. Well, we'll keep trying. All right. And my sister okay. got her second shot on her birthday, so it was a very oh. good birthday present for her. Oh, oh good. It's exciting. Good. It's exciting. My mom's Someone. getting her second shot this oh. weekend for her birthday. Yay. Mama Bone, yay. I'm so jealous. Okay. God, I would shove her out of the way if I could. Okay. Tw- hmm? Oh, I'm sorry. 46 minutes. You don't look old enough. That was your outside voice, Stephanie. No, 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 no. Yeah. It's Tuesday. <clears throat> you know what that means.